Tyler Life. So it's Thursday, May 20th, and we are just about to McKean County Raceway for their opening night, which was postponed from a few weeks ago because it was cold and it had snowed all week. It's about 90 degrees out. It's really nice, hopefully. There's lots of water on the track, so it's not too dry and dusty. You got anything to say? <laughs> no. Hopefully we have a good night. That's all I can say. Right there from Saturday night. Put in victory lane. You know what I just thought of? Mm. Is your son coming? My son? Yeah. Yeah. The Taros are in his truck. My Taros are? We don't have any Taros. Why didn't you tell me that? Because I've just been using his Taros because you used his, he used your Taros all year last year. There was a, there's a pair of Taros in the back. They are parked over there. last time somebody got stuck right there. Yeah. Before 
what is it, four and a half inches? Yeah. No, no, it's four. Four, yeah. Whatever the rule is. Where I put my Those are just seat belts had very well that on the, the bracket that was already there and cut all them stupid extra holes out so the tech guy would quit pitching. Remember they told us we had to either cut them out or weld plates over them? Yeah. Oh, no, that's... Oh. I mean, I no, but oh. all these guys down here too. Oh, oh you mean and that? the guy at Bradford. Well, he never made me that one. Not the new tech guy, the oh. one before oh, that. Yeah, yeah. One before yeah. Yeah. Yeah, to yeah, yeah. My friend Clarence? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of him looking at it. Can I take that can off, Uncle? We gotta get the air compressor out. Load on. You want me just to plug the, the power strip in over there? Dennis, get me the power strip. Jenna, grab me the air, the power strip. I don't know where the hell it is. I don't either. Do I? I don't put the stuff in the truck. Do I? While well, you're in there, you can search for a battery in my battery jug too. Oh my God. <laughs> Dennis, you don't understand. I need it for work. I know, but I've searched in here 30 times. Well, you, we're going to have everything out tonight, so that'd be a good time to search. Every day at work. I look every day. I look every time. I'm moving. Richard brought Caden's car. I know. Richard was over here. No, I didn't know Richard was over here. I wasn't over here then. I didn't know he was all buddy buddies with Amy though. Know. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know why. I'm not, I don't record.
He's after ProMod. He's after ProMods. Or no, there's minis and then ProMods. Sorry. sitting here chilling in the truck because Dennis went up to the bleachers and I didn't want to go and it's kind of cold and I'm fighting with my phone to charge fun 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 right now they just started well they didn't just start they sent the crates out for their feature and the track was a hot mess it was so dusty you couldn't see anything so they had a red flag on the first lap just because the track was blocked. Then they had a couple more cautions. They eventually got to lap three and they had to my brain is not working. They had to pull all their cars to the infield and water the track. So Apparently we're done for the night. We just went over to Watt to see what was going on because we heard a car running and the guy was loading it. They have decided, I guess, to end for the night because of track conditions and they don't want to be responsible for someone getting hurt. Um, that's all we really know right now. Uh, so. I don't know. I guess we're gonna load up and go home. Oh God, wait! Did you do it? Oh, you had to do it.
Okay, since the vlog kind of abruptly finished the other night while we were at Smithport, um, they did cancel the races. Um, as of right now, there is not a set in stone plan. Um, Joel did post something this morning. What it's looking like is they will be honoring, number one, they will be running all the features, no heats, just some hot laps and a ULMS dash of some sort. And then um, they will honor all of the pit vans. Good thing I saved them. I told everyone, take your mouth and save them and give them to me while well, they didn't give them to me. So we rummaged around the house and found them all this morning. And um, they will be letting everyone in the grandstands for free. Whether you were there or not, Grandstand admission will be free next Thursday. Um, it'll, yeah, this should be up before then. But um, Dennis was scheduled to start on the pole. So he will be starting on the pole again. But, uh, yeah, so right now it's Saturday morning and we are getting, we had some things to do this morning. So we are getting packed up to head down to the bird and to camp and i am super excited and i'm just going to show you guys real quick uh what happened thursday night while we were at the races so we left duramax and fiona home on thursday night because we knew fiona was getting close and we didn't want to leave her home alone so duramax had to stay home with her and we were just about home. We got a panic phone call from Blaze. Where are you? How long before you're here? And I said, well, we're about 10 minutes away. Why? And he said, I just walked into Fiona and a pile of puppies on my bed. So we have eight little puppies and Miss Fiona will be spending the next few weeks at home she won't be able to go to camp with us um, but once the puppies transition to food we will start taking them along with us to give them some socialization okay so i am gonna go ahead and finish getting packed and i will end this um we will pick back up on our way to the track probably and uh, make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on all the fun. <sighs> Hit the thumbs up button if you liked this video. It lets us know what you like to see. It lets YouTube know that you're watching our videos. And don't forget, be fast or be last.